Hello, my name is Khalil. I graduated in 1988 from CEG. During the orientation, we presented you an overview of the English Communication Initiative. As promised, I am here today with several members of the team to provide more details and talk about the many parts of the initiative. We will start with a brief introduction to CEG Betterment and the English Communication Initiative. You will then learn how to assess yourself and seek appropriate help if desired. This will be followed by a senior professor who is also an alumnus, giving his perspective based on his long experience working with students. In the last part, we will discuss the different parts of the initiative and hear from the stakeholders. We will start with a brief introduction to CEG Betterment and the English Communication Initiative. Here is Dr. Shanta Mohan, who has been at the forefront of CEG Betterment from the beginning to tell you all about it. Hello students, it gives me great pleasure to be able to talk to you today. My name is Shanta and I graduated from CEG in 1971, 50 years ago. I'm very active in the North American CEG Alumni Association as a board member. Last year, we started mentoring program for CEG students called Ask a CEG. When mentors and students interacted with each other, the alumni learned that a lot of things need improvement at CEG to make the students' experience better. We wanted to find out what things needed improvement. We conducted a student survey and close to 800 students responded. From the survey results, we gathered a list of things that needed improvement and created a project called the CEG Betterment. The English Communication Initiative is one of the initiatives under CEG Betterment. We understood that when students join CEG, they are not aware how important English communication is while they are studying. Even more importantly, how much they need it when they graduate. We also heard that after the first couple of semesters of learning English in the first year, the students don't get much chance to practice their communication skills. As we go through this induction workshop, we will introduce you to the different aspects of this English Communication Initiative. You will hear from your seniors, alumni coaches, and club leaders. As part of raising awareness for the importance of English communication, a few months ago, we invited Bharati Bhaskar, a CEG and Anna University alumna, and a celebrated motivational speaker to tell the students why English communication is important. Please listen to what she has to say. In Reke, India Vukulum Seri, Ulagatu Kulum Seri, Irikira Ma Perum Inepu Muriaga, Angilam, Mudalidati, Pritikura. In the Namaka Pudika Merkala, Namaka Ishtaila Merkala, and it is a wound me. The wound may Wangi Kolevin. The wound may Ye Wangi Kanaka or கிட்டத்தட்ட <laughs> என்னுடைய மகள் ஆங்கிலத்தில் பேச முடிந்தது என்ன அவளுக்கு அப்ப ஆறு வயசு இருந்தா கூட அது மாதிரியான பள்ளியில சேர்த்ததால அவளால பேச முடிந்தது ஆங்கிலத்தில் அங்க ஆங்கிலத்தில் வருகிற அறிவிப்புகளை அவளால் புரிந்து கொள்ள முடிந்தது அந்த ஜப்பானிய குழந்தைக்கு அது அறவே தெரியவில்லை ஆங்கிலம் அவளுக்கு அறவே தெரியவில்லை அப்ப அந்த ஜப்பானிய தந்தை சொன்னார் எங்கள் நாட்டில் நாங்கள் ஜப்பானிய மொழியில் தான் கற்பிக்கிறோம் ஆங்கிலமே எங்களுக்கு இப்ப அவசியம் 
அப்படின்னு எங்க நாட்டுல நினைக்கலன்னு சொன்னேன் இது நடந்து இருபது வருஷம் ஆகிறது நண்பர்களே ஆனால் இன்றைக்கு ஜப்பானில் நிலைமை வேறு இன்றைக்கு ஜப்பானியர்கள் கூட ஆங்கிலத்தை ஆரம்ப நிலையிலிருந்தே அவர்கள் குழந்தைகளுக்கு கற்றுக் கொடுத்தால் தான் உலகத்தோடு தொடர்பு கொள்ளுதல் எளிதாகும் என்ற முடிவுக்கு ஜப்பான் வந்துடுது இப்ப ஜப்பான்ல சொல்லிட்டா நாம செய்யணுமானா அதுக்காக நான் சொல்லல ஆனால் உலக நாடுகளில் தங்களினுடைய மொழி மாத்திரமே போதும் என்று நினைத்த பல உலக நாடுகள் இன்றைக்கு தங்களினுடைய மொழிக்கான முக்கியத்துவத்தை குறைக்கவில்லை ஆனால் ஆங்கிலத்தையும் தங்களினுடைய பிள்ளைகள் சிறு வயதிலிருந்தே படிக்க வேண்டும் என்ற முடிவுக்கு உலகத்தில் பல நாடுகள் வந்துவிட்டன இந்த உண்மையை நீங்கள் முதலில் தெரிந்து கொள்ள வேண்டும் அது ஐரோப்பாவில் இருக்கிற பல நாடுகளா இருக்கலாம் பிரான்ஸா இருக்கலாம் ஜப்பானா இருக்கலாம் ரஷ்யாவா இருக்கலாம் அவர்கள் எல்லாம் தாய்மொழியில் தான் பெரும்பாலும் படிக்கிறார்கள் ஆனாலும் ஆங்கிலத்தை கற்க ஆரம்பித்து விட்ட ஒரு தலைமுறை அங்கே வளர்ந்து வருகிறது நமக்கு வந்து ஒரு அட்வான்டேஜ் இருந்தேன்னா இங்கிலீஷ்காரன் இங்க ஆட்சி செஞ்சிருக்கான் அதனால பல்ல ஆண்டுகளா கிட்டத்தட்ட நூத்தி எழுபத்தி அஞ்சு வருஷங்களா ஆங்கிலம் வந்து எப்படியோ புகுத்தப்பட்டு விட்டது நம்முடைய பல நூல்கள் அறிவு தளத்திலே இருக்கிற எல்லா நூல்களும் ஆங்கிலத்திலே மொழிபெயர்க்கப்பட்டு இருக்கின்றன இந்தியாவினுடைய அறிவு தளத்தில் என்னென்ன அது பகவத்கீதையிலிருந்து நீங்க ஆரம்பிச்சு அது சமண சமய நூல்களா இருக்கட்டும் பௌத்த சமய நூல்களா இருக்கட்டும் இட் பி லிட்ரேச்சர் இட் குட் பி இட் குட் பி மெடிசின் இந்திய அறிவு துறையில் எந்த மொழியில் இருந்த நூல்களும் ஆங்கிலத்திலே மொழிபெயர்க்கப்பட்டு விட்டது அதனால ஆங்கிலம்தான் இணைப்பு மொழியாக எப்போதும் இருக்கும் என்பதையும் உலக நாடுகளோடு கை குலுக்குவதற்கு எல்லா நாடுகளுமே இன்னைக்கு ஆங்கிலத்தை ஏற்றுக்கொண்டு விட்டார்கள் என்பதை தயவு செய்து முதலிலே நாம் புரிந்து கொள்கிறோம் இப்படி சொல்றதுனால ஆ நீ உடனே தமிழ் துரோகி கிடையாது என்னை விட நான் ஒரு சவாலாவே சொல்றேன் நான் திமிரா பேசுறேன் நீங்க நினைச்சா தயவு செஞ்சு மன்னிச்சுக்கோங்க நான் தேவையில்லாத விஷயங்களுக்காக சொல்லல எனக்கு தமிழ் இலக்கியத்தில் இருக்கிற ஆர்வம் இன்றைக்கு தமிழ் கொடி பிடிக்கிற எல்லாரையும் விட எனக்கு நிறைய ஆர்வம் உண்டு எனக்கு பயிற்சி உண்டு சங்க தமிழ் பாடல்களில் இருந்து திருக்குறளில் இருந்து கமராமாயணத்தில் இருந்து சார் சொன்னார் நேற்றுக்கு தான் மகாகவி பாரதியினுடைய நினைவு நாள் வந்ததுன்னு அந்த பாரதியிலிருந்து கண்ணதாசனிலிருந்து தமிழ் இலக்கியத்தில் பயின்று வருகிற ஒரு மாணவி நான் எனக்கு என்னோட தாய்மொழி எனக்கு உயிர் மாதிரி எனக்கான அடையாளமே அதுதான் When you arrive at CEG, you may not know where you are with respect to your English communication skills. To be a good English communicator, it is important that you know the English language. There are some self-assessment tools that can help you understand your level of comfort with the English language. You may want to use these tools to see where you are. The British Council's online English level test is one of those tools. This will give you an approximate indication of your English level. It has 25 multiple choice questions and it takes only 10 to 20 minutes. You will be asked to choose the correct answer. Then decide how sure you are that your answer is correct. Whether you are certain, fairly sure, not sure. Be honest about how sure you are. Your score depends on the answers you give and how sure you are. Your result will be in one of these possible levels. Beginner to pre-intermediate, intermediate and upper intermediate are above. You would want to seek help if you are a beginner to pre-intermediate level. English Score is a mobile app that can help you with your assessment. You can download this app and take a free test to assess your English language skills. You will need to pay for a certificate, but you don't need the certificate just to get a self-assessment. After taking the self-assessment, what do you do with it? For sure, if you find that you are at the bottom, you would need to get help because the level at which you are will determine how well you can absorb all the lessons that are going to be provided to you in CEG, which are in English. You would also want to know that your communication skills are good enough for you to be able to interact with others your professors, 
later on uh, in the final year in your interview and in your placement. If you need help after you take your self-assessment, please reach out to your English department or you can write to the email given here, help.englishcom at sigana.org. Thank you, Shanta. Let's now hear what CEG former Dean, Professor Shekhar, who has spent nearly 50 years on campus as a student, teacher, and administrator has to say. Professor Shekhar. Hello and welcome. I'm really happy to join Shanta and Khalil. in sharing my ideas and opinion, observations concerning the English communication of the College of Engineering Hindi students as I observed all my years of service. Uh, to just make a small introduction, I've been the student of Hindi Engineering College from 1971. I had the opportunity of being the head of the institution as Dean of the Indian Engineering College for seven long years. So during this period, as a student, as a teacher, as a Dean of this college, having observed the students' capabilities in speaking in English, I think that I can share some of my ideas and opinion about what is needed and how we are going to do it. In the Angilatla Pesamo, a pringer the Epri Mukyo, a green party, பேசக்கூடிய நமக்கு வந்து நம்ம தொழில் ரீதியாகவும் அலுவலக ரீதியாகவும் பார்க்கும்போது போத் இந்த ப்ரொஃபஷன் அண்ட் இந்த அஃபிஷியல் டியூட்டிஸ் தட் வி பெர்ஃபார்ம் வி நீட் இங்கிலீஷ் வி நீட் எ குட் கம்யூனிகேஷன் இங்கிலீஷ் ஸோ தட் வி எக்ஸ்பிரஸ் அவர் சர்ஸ் நம்ம என்ன நினைக்கிறோன்றது சொல்றதுக்கும் அதை வந்து மற்றவங்க அதை வந்து சரியாக புரிஞ்சுக்கிறதுக்கும் இந்த ஆங்கிலத்தில் நமக்கு பேசுகின்ற திறமை சரியாக பேசுகின்ற திறமை மிக முக்கியம் ஸோ அதனால தான் இந்த கம்யூனிகேஷன் ஸ்கில்ஸ் அதுலேயும் இங்கிலீஷ் கம்யூனிகேஷன் ஸ்கில்ஸுங்கிறது ரொம்ப முக்கியமாக தேவைப்படுது அண்ட் திஸ் கைண்ட் ஆஃப் நெசசிட்டி ஆஃப் ஸ்பீக்கிங் இங்கிலீஷ் யூ வில் ஃபீல் அண்ட் மெனி ஆஃப் தி ஸ்டூடெண்ட்ஸ் ஃபெல்ட் வென் தே சேட் ஃபார் தி இன்டர்வியூஸ் இன் தேர் ஃபைன் தேர் But it was too late and what has happened is that at that particular time they couldn't perform well. And that's the reason we want to ensure and tell you that pick up English as early as possible. And try to be, it is not going to be a tough job at all because it needs some practice and a good trainer will always make you speak English, good English, even in our own classroom. just to raise your question to the teacher mostly we are going to be speaking english only you will feel shy to ask the question because you are not sure whether you are going to correct good speak a good english so there simply you will say and keep quiet and then leave the class like it it keeps on happening making a big drawback 
for your own understanding of the subject in the class itself. So when you can express yourself in good English and in your learning the lessons in the class also, asking your doubts in your to your teacher also, or conversing with your friends also is going to be very very helpful. Because especially in engineering, you know, it all concerns with projects, whatever be the branch of engineering it is. And all these projects require presentation of the projects to the higher-ups, to the people who are maybe somewhere, you may be uh, submitting a tender or something, or you may be submitting a project proposal to a funding agency. So in all these places, you require to present yourself properly. And there, you know, there you mean naturally you have to do it in the English language. So, right from your classroom to your boardroom, as you can call. Knowledge of English speaking and going to speak good English is very, very important. I wish that all you people get benefited and then from this particular initiative that is taken up by the alumni of the College of Engineering in India. Wish you all the best. I really thank for this opportunity. Thank you very much. Thank you, Professor Shekhar. Many students are shy or averse to asking questions in class or when in a group. If that's you, one-to-one -one coaching is for you. As the name suggests, here each student will be coached individually. There are about 40 alumni who are coaching nearly 70 students. The schedule mode, WhatsApp, Teams, in-person, Skype, or whatever you are comfortable with, and the approach will be decided by the coach and the student. Let's hear more from Coach Nerur and Coach Ranganathan, followed by students Nagaraj and Deepa. Greetings to everyone. My name is Nerur Kumar, CEG alumnus, Mechanical Branch. I reside in Pittsburgh, USA. My warm welcome to the young engineers who have joined this great institution. Exciting times await you, and for the engineers of the future, sky is the limit. Let us discuss about importance of effective communication skill. As engineers, we are professionals. Communication is key in our field. We are expected to exhibit professionalism in all spheres of life, in college, in work. Effective communication is must in various leadership roles as engineer. As we grow and as we assume responsibilities as project managers or head of construction or in various other mission critical projects, Effective communication is the key for the success of the project as well as success of the individual to grow. My approach to English communication coaching is to be a practical trainer. I'm currently coaching students from both Tamil medium as well as English medium education. Student and I get to know each other well we discuss and come up with an action plan. We follow your defined daily and weekly schedule. I have one-on-one -on -one meeting with the students. We have group discussion among the students. All this helps the students to overcome the inhibitions of speaking in English and also speaking in a group setting, and it helps to improve their fluency in English conversation. I also share periodical grammar tips and I review the progress with each student I'm coaching. In short, the idea is to improve upon the soft skills, mainly focusing on English communication. Start early to learn. Learning is a continuous effort. My request is to start early when you have the time to spare. As years roll by, you will find yourself in the final year. At that point of time, you will have plenty to work upon. Your subjects, your project work, preparation for the assessment, preparation for aptitude test, 
HR interview, technical interview, so on and so forth. To manage and to catch up on the communication skills at that point of time would be an enormous task. So again, my request is start early now when you have the time to spare. Once again, welcome to the College of Engineering Grindy, the great institution and best wishes to your wonderful future. Thank you all. Hi there, I'm Ranganathan. I did my BE in ECE, MSc Engineering in Communication Systems Engineering and Doctorate from College of Engineering, Gindi. This initiative by Shanta is a very commendable effort for improving the communication skills of CEG students. I can say I am the living example of a person who joined the CEG with practically no English knowledge as I studied all my schooling in Tamil medium. On the first day, it was very difficult for me. I was totally lost. Some of the students may face a situation similar to that today. Now in this program, mentors offer help to students to improve their English, English communication skills. How this is done? Each mentor may have his or her own approach. My approach is to evaluate every student on the first interaction, try to identify where they stand and also identify from them where they want to reach. Now, based on these two, we have a uh, approach. Now, however good a person may be to begin with, there is always scope for improvement in vocabulary, use of grammar and confidence. I encourage my students to improve their vocabulary by regular, regularly reading English newspapers and English story books. Now, while doing this reading, I request them to write down the difficult words. Now, these difficult words will be written down, their meanings will be sought and the meanings also will be written down and each student will make one statement for using each word. That sentence will be formed using simple rules. Now, sometimes the uh, word may have more than one meaning. So, at that time, the student is expected to write more than one sentence. I strongly recommend students to write simple sentences. Only thing is they have to take care of agreement between the verb and the noun in terms of numbers and tense. Now, if somebody, if some student improves sufficiently, I ask them to write one full page essay on some topic. Normally, on Sundays, students will send their uh, work to me by email. I spend adequate time on the work of the students, identify if the sentences are correct. If the sentences are correct, I appreciate the students for the same. The sentences may be from the essays or from the sentences they have written for on words. If there are some mistakes in the sentences, I suggest corrections. Now this uh, session takes about half an hour every Sunday. At the end of each session, I take a feedback. I have also helped a final year student to confidently face the placement process. Now confidence comes from the knowledge of the subject. One must develop different ideas on technical aspects on current affairs. There are certain ways to put forward your ideas in group discussions and in interview session. If you are able to do it fairly well, there will be no problem. Now, this way, mastering English is a very simple process. All the best. Hello everyone, this is Navaraj. I am here to discuss about the CEG Betterment English Communication Initiative program which was made by our beloved CEG alumni. 
and i am one of the students under coaching which is going on now and i am nagaraj s i am pursuing my undergraduate degree in be mining engineering in a prestigious as college of engineering in the anna university and i have completed my schooling in gumudi pundi it is just away from 50 kilometers from chennai and my medium of instruction is english only and then why then english communication is important i feel to us if we go anywhere in the world it will be more helpful for us to communicate with others and even in our country too because most of our tamilians do not know hindi for to read and write and even to speak and it will be more helpful to attend any interviews if especially our campus interviews or our government examinations interviews uh, like that and without fear we will be able to attend it and it will be also helpful in make presentations in a department forums and share our knowledge and it will be useful for us to make small talk with us and to speak public speak in public confidently without fear and it will also help helpful in attending the competitive exams to perform well in the part of english in the writing and what are the benefits which i had from this english communication coaching or i have made good uh, vocabulary skills and my shyness to speak in english has gone off and i have improved a lot in my fluency and tonal variations and pronunciation of the words and my writing in english has also improved a lot by by the series of lectures given by them and the series of uh, test test conducted by them and i also gained knowledge about how to attend interviews and what are the expectations of the interviewers and and learned how to make a good conversation with others and also how we face group discussions this is a good uh, club which provides uh, opportunity to learn and uh, practice our english communication and to develop and uh, we, we we should make use of that thank you i'm deepa and i'm from chennai i'm currently pursuing be material science and engineering from anna university gindi i completed my schooling from malinal m meta girls i secondary school chennai even though i'm from english medium i used to speak tamil and hindi during my school days so i'm not fluent in speaking english i cannot blame my school or any surrounding for this it is mainly due to me because i am not i, I have not taken any step in improving my english speaking skill until i came across interview process i am not aware of the communication skill i had been rejected from two of the companies one lti and the other company caterpillar because of my poor communication skill later i realized the need for english communication coaching so it is essential to secure an interview to get a job to advance in your career so i joined uh, cegcom one to one coaching it is an initiative um, done by the cg alumni so i joined it so they and they provided me a list of alumni where i selected an alumni out of my random choice and i started my coaching as a result of coaching i saw an improvement in me i started speaking with confidence and it provides me clarity in speaking also it enhanced my professional image where i stopped using those short forms and started texting or mailing anyone in a very detailed manner 
These are the improvements I observed in me as a result of coaching. If you have interest and if you are job focused, you can join this coaching. Definitely, you will be benefited. I came across this platform only in the final year. You guys are very lucky enough. So, join this coaching as soon as possible. It not only essential for your career, it also essential for your personal development. So, I recommend every individual to join this coaching uh, because you will, you will be even aware of the campus placements from the first year itself. So, you will be start, you will find your path and you will go uh, in that direction. So, I believe everyone will join this coaching and uh, improve their communication skills. Thank you everyone and thank you for this opportunity. Thank you coaches and students. The coaches have been doing a phenomenal job adjusting their approach to each student as required. The English club is based on the buddy system or peer-to-peer -peer system. Here, students get together to help each other and to keep each other motivated. It allows the teaching to take place literally anywhere, anytime. Let's hear what the student Logeshwaran, a founding member of the club, has to say. Logesh. Welcome to all the first year students. Here's a short presentation on the English club. Hello, I'm Logeshwaran. I'm a third year civil engineering student. I have founded the English club intending to help the students with Tamil medium background enhance their communication skills. Well, here's a question for you. Do you speak English? For many English learners, speaking is the most difficult part of the language to master. To improve your speaking skills, you need to be able to practice with other English learners or English speakers. One way to do this is by joining an English club. There are many reasons why this English club can help learners improve their English. The most important reason is that it offers learners a chance to practice English by actually speaking it. There are other advantages too. It's less formal than a classroom setting. Many learners find it more fun than the usual English classes. It also lets learners practice English in more real life situations. This can increase a learner's desire to practice and learn on their own. The English club is a peer-to-peer -peer buddy system that is self-directed to improve communication skills, pairing those who are proficient in English with those who want to enhance their skills, especially those who come from Tamil medium schools and have not had the chance to practice their English speaking skills. This is a club for the students run by the students. Conversations between a few students as opposed to a larger group allow for greater understanding. This kind of conversation is more comfortable, which encourages sharing doubts and asking questions about the correct usage of English. You can use this club to enhance what you are taught in English class, thereby making you a better communicator. The club has started with seven students. Some of the students are facilitators who help run the programs for the club. So far, the club has had several meetings each of which had a different type of activity such as watching an English video and discussing it, playing online games and having conversations. This club mainly focuses on speaking skills. The one hour live meetings will be conducted on the weekends. Well, English is an important language for all kinds of professional and personal goals. Whether you are just starting in English or you need some motivation to keep going, Understanding the importance of the language will help you reach fluency and change your life. If you would like to help, become a facilitator. If you would like to enhance your communication skills, please join the club. You will be able to practice without any pressure from teachers or coaches. We have a safe community on CEG communication teams for collaboration. Thank you. Thank you, Logesh. Scared to face an audience, but would love to give an inspiring speech. We have a speech club for you. Modeled after Toastmasters and guided by senior Toastmasters Shanta and Mani, 
This club was formed last month and has had two fun meetings. Everyone enjoyed it and we are looking forward to the next meeting. Here's Gokul, founding member of the club, to tell you what it is about. Hello everyone, this is Gokul, a final year student from Computer Science and Engineering Department. As a part of English Communication Initiative, we have formed a student speech club. The CEG Speakaholics is patterned after Toastmasters, so it provides a safe space for the students to practice their communication and the presentation skills. The CEG Speakaholics meet once in a two week on Saturday evening for about an hour. We have an agenda with one or two prepared speeches, a section on impromptu speaking and a section for providing feedback to the speakers. Many people have a phobia of public speaking. According to most studies, people's number one fear is public speaking, number two is death. You know, death is number two. Even though public speaking can be scary, it is possible to succeed in spite of these fears with preparation and practice. It can be very satisfying to share something that matters to you with people outside your usual social circle. There are totally about three sections in every meeting. So I just like to give some brief detail about these sections. The first one is a prepared speech section. The process of writing a speech will exercise and strengthen your critical thinking skills. Preparing a speech will force you to reevaluate the way you communicate and re-examine your speaking habits. When you write a speech, you have to think carefully about the best organizational framework and pursue some good strategy and language to communicate your message to the audience. This type of thinking can help you improve your communication skill and in other areas of your life too. The next section is impromptu speaking. There are plenty of impromptu situations where we are required to speak such as job interviews, school or college quizzes, conference calls, meetings uh, or even a social occasions like birthdays, uh, anniversaries or weddings etc etc. Being able to speak effectively off the curve in, is a huge advantage, especially when mixed with some humor. It will build both your professional and a social profile. It helps you with your listening skills and be open-minded to experience. The last section is a feedback section. So the feedback section is to provide input to, the, to those who speak and also evaluate the meeting for continuous improvement. It builds your skill for critical analysis and providing useful feedback when you are doing evaluations of presentations and written articles. We invite you to participate in CEG Speakerholics and enhance your communication skills. Thank you. Thank you, Gokul. I like to chat, I like to read, I consume a lot of information, and I like to browse. You can do that too. Here's Shanta to tell you about the resources available to you. Shanta? There are a number of resources available to you when you sign up for individual coaching in the English Communication Initiative. There is a community environment in Teams called CEGCOM. There is an online database of resources called GOLD. We hope you can make use of these tools to enrich your English communication skills. The English Communication Initiative has created a Teams environment from Microsoft for the coaches and students to interact. This Teams environment is a community where you can ask questions and get answers. You can interact with your coach using chats, private chats. It has a general channel made up of all the members. There is also a channel reserved for coaches to learn from each other in coaching the students. We all would like to know what kind of approach each coach is taking in coaching the students and we learn from each other. There is a channel for English club members to interact. English club is made up of peer-to-peer -peer interaction, as we saw earlier. And this Teams environment allows the English club members to talk to each other, 
schedule their meetings and generally make use of all the resources that are available to them. The resource channel has a wiki for all the reference material used in English communication coaching. When you sign up for coaching, you will be added to this team. Gold in the online live database is a tool that's available to all the students from the mentorship program called Ask a CEGM. We believe students learn much from their peers as they do from their professors. Traditionally, the best practices have been shared among the students in an ad hoc fashion from batch to batch. This tribal knowledge is lost when a batch graduates without passing it on and the chain of transfer is broken. Gindi Online Live Database, GOLD, is an attempt to address this problem by creating an online space for sharing such a knowledge base. It is crowdsourced from alumni to share their experiences and knowledge with the current students. It's free for viewing. There is a section specifically for English communication skills, and you can see the table of contents uh, that is shown here. We hope you can make use of this online live database. And if you have any questions on the teams are on gold, please email help.englishcom at sigana.org. You now know about the English Communication Initiative and its various aspects. And remember, everybody needs help sometime or the other. At CEG, help is only an email away. Good luck and let the journey begin.